Hey everyone, enjoy the show. How you doing today? Boy, do I have a special treat for y'all. And most of you know that I kind of specialize in antique saloon items. Uh, I'm always looking for like really nice saloon artwork and I came up with one of the greatest pieces I've been able to buy in years. If you see here, this would be a representative of a bar in 1907 in Los Angeles on Los Angeles Street. Okay, this is 07. This would be a really high class bar down in Los Angeles. There were quite a few high class bars, San Francisco, Los Angeles, San Francisco, all the big cities had beautiful, beautiful bars. That's 07. If you walked in there today, you would be in absolute awe. Okay, moving right along. So I, a guy called me, which I get a lot of calls from around the country, and especially in Los Angeles because of our huge web presence and all of the things we do. And he said, I got some nice antiques at my house. He lived by the Los Angeles airport. So I went down to his house and his father had owned a bunch of cool stuff, this being one of them. So I bought everything he had. Uh, so this particular piece, he gave me a letter with it and I'm going to try to get through this and read it to you. It says, which obviously you'll be getting a copy of this and this is a copy, but it's legit. If you see it's old script, okay? It says to whom it may concern, uh, this is to testify that in the year 1907, Captain A. Frank of San Pedro stepped, stored with us in our place of business at North Los Angeles Street for safekeeping one oil painting, large size, about four feet by seven feet in a large gold frame, representing a nude woman reclining butte on a lounge. Upon the order of Captain Frank's, stating that Chris Kiplinger had purchased said picture from him was delivered to him in the year 1908 to Mr. Kaplan, Los Angeles, California. This letter is dated 1923. So I believe that later on, after this hung in this bar, they went back to him and said, hey, can you give us a letter on, the, on, on what's up? So this comes with it. So once again, this is about four feet by seven feet, the actual oil painting. Then we have, I don't even have an idea what it would cost you to build a frame like this today. This frame is like six inches, five and a half inches deep, just a spectacular gold frame. I did not do anything to it. I thought about maybe doing a satin clear coat. It would have made it pop, but I thought, you know what? Let me leave it alone. If you guys want to do something with it, you can. I don't want to mess with it. Uh, this is as it was. There is no signature. I cannot find a signature on it. That's really kind of weird that I can't find a signature on it, but it's done, it doesn't concern me because I know that this is a period correct European quality, beautiful oil painting. I'm going to, me and Heimer are going to open it, uh, turn it around here so you can see the back. What's really nice is when you see the back, it's going to have canvas on the back. And obviously the picture's on the front. And then there's like a three inch void between it. And I think that's one of the reasons that this has survived in such beautiful condition over all these years was because the back was never exposed to the elements. This is one killer, killer piece. Why don't you come around here, Jeff? I'm gonna this come is, over here. Yeah, yeah, go right down here. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this out. I can get you stills, but I want you to see this while we're talking about it. Look at the back of this. Looks this like is, a back bar. <laughs> this is almost as spectacular. You see, and then the oil painting is on the other side. So there's like a four inch void between this and the front. And once again, I think that's why uh, this thing survived so nicely. Look at the quality of that frame and how it was all put together, right? Is that cool? I mean, this is a legitimate. It's got the original hangers here, right and left. This is a legitimate bitchin' piece of antique saloon nude reclining oil painting. I mean, if you have a big bar or a big something, get this hung, it's gonna be fantastic. So, it was brought in 07. When was it done? I don't know. It could have been 1858, not 1850. 1880, 1890, 1901, something like that, because it came here in 07. So when was it actually painted? I don't know. Super high quality, just absolute beautiful. 
She's laying down on a really nice lounge recliner, original frame. The frame is in fabulous condition. It's no, there's no chips, breaks, cracks, nothing. Uh, I got this out of the garage. Uh, super, super nice piece. Somebody's gonna be very lucky to have this now. As you see it back there, I'm gonna hang it up here right now. So I, it's been floating around the shop and I can't have that. It's gonna get bumped into. So me and Jaime, as soon as this video's done, it's going up and it's getting stored. I suggest it's pricey, it's a beautiful piece. Man, come take a look at it for yourself. You know what I mean? Come out, fly out, drive out, whatever you wanna do. Come take a look at it and we'll, we'll talk about it. Beautiful piece. I, we, this will be crated and shipped. We're gonna shoot your price uh, on our listing and this will be professionally crated and brought to your home. Anyway, somebody's gonna get a rare, one of a kind, stunning barroom nude and I just, I love it. If you don't buy it, it's all right with me. I'll just keep it for my retirement. I'm gonna put it in my sleeve. Anyway, thanks for watching. So uh, we really want to tell you we appreciate you watching our videos. We've done about 1,600 of them to date, and uh, you guys respond very nicely to it, and we really appreciate it. So if you like them, man, smash the subscribe button, right? Boom, hit the subscribe button and click on the reminder button, and if you do that, you will get reminded. There's a little bell there. Click on that. Uh, what we'd like you to do is make comments, and please make sure you share it with your friends. You guys are taking us to the top of the YouTube channel, and if you do those three things, you'll be able to see uh, us real time, especially if you hit the bell to remind you. It'll come up every time on your phone. We try to do a lot of fun stuff for y'all, and we appreciate you watching our videos. So let's smash it, let's grab it, let's watch them, let's comment, let's send us comments, share it with your friends. If you do that, you'll take us to the top, and we would really appreciate it. These are Mantiques. Antique, Mantique. These guys sell Mantiques. This is their store. We're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from nine to five or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.